ever wondered what are the top things to do in Osaka, Japan? Welcome fellow explorers to a journey filled with endless excitement, brimming with culture and steeped in tradition. Today we are venturing into the heart of Osaka, a city renowned for its vibrant nightlife, delectable street food and rich history. In this video, we'll be unveiling the top 10 things to do in this bustling metropolis. From the towering majesty of Osaka Castle, the lively streets of Dotonbori, to the culinary delights of Osaka's street food, we've got it all covered. We'll also be delving into a world of fun at Universal Studios Japan, exploring the underwater wonders at Osaka Aquarium Kayuken, and taking a refreshing trip to Minu Park. So buckle up and prepare your senses for an incredible journey. There's a world of adventure waiting for you in Osaka. Stay tuned for the countdown of the top 10 things to do in Osaka. Starting off our countdown at number 10, we have the Osaka Castle. Imposing yet elegant, Osaka Castle is a testament to Japan's rich history and it's a must-visit spot for anyone who appreciates architecture and history. Constructed in the late 16th century by Toyotomi Hideyoshi, a renowned samurai warrior and politician, the castle was a symbol of power and grandeur. Despite facing numerous challenges, including wars and natural disasters, it has managed to retain its glory and charm making it a living piece of history. The castle complex is expansive, housing an impressive central tower surrounded by secondary citadels, gates, turrets and stone walls. Inside, you'll find a museum that takes you on a journey through time with exhibits showcasing ancient artifacts, armor and weapons. Don't forget to climb to the top of the main tower where you'll be rewarded with a panoramic view of Osaka city. Not only does it provide an insight into Japan's feudal past, but Osaka castle is also a place of tranquility. Its sprawling grounds adorned with cherry blossom trees offer a serene escape from the bustling city. If you're lucky enough to visit during the cherry blossom season, you're in for a real treat. A trip to Osaka isn't complete without a visit to this iconic landmark. With its rich history and beautiful architecture, Osaka Castle is a must-see. Coming in at number 9, we have the vibrant Dotonbori. If you've ever wondered where the pulse of Osaka beats loudest, look no further. Dotonbori is a riot of color, sound and flavor that never sleeps. Let's start with the nightlife. Imagine a place where the setting sun signals the start of an endless party. Streets bathed in neon lights, laughter echoing off buildings and music from every corner. This is Dotonbori after dark. It's a place where you can lose yourself in the crowd, dance to the rhythm of the city and make memories that last a lifetime. But what's a party without food, right? Dotonbori is a foodie's paradise. From mouth-watering takoyaki to succulent yakitori skewers, the food scene here is as diverse as it is delicious. And let's not forget about the iconic giant mechanical crabs, signaling the presence of Kani Doraku, a famous crab restaurant. It's a culinary adventure that you won't want to miss. And for those who enjoy a good shopping spree, Dotonbori has you covered. With a maze of shops selling everything from high-end fashion to quirky souvenirs, there's something for everyone. It's the perfect place to find that unique gift or simply treat yourself. Dotonbori is truly the heart of Osaka's nightlife. It's a place where the city's energy is most palpable where the spirit of Osaka comes alive. It's a place you'll want to experience firsthand. 
At number 8, we recommend shopping in Shinsaibashi. A bustling district in Osaka, Shinsaibashi is a haven for shopping enthusiasts. This vibrant area offers a cornucopia of retail options, promising to satisfy every type of shopper. Stroll down the Shinsaibashi Suji shopping street, a covered arcade that stretches over half a mile. Here you'll find an array of stores, from high-end brands that attract luxury seekers to local boutiques that feature unique made in Japan items. Whether you're after the latest fashion trends from international designers or seeking traditional Japanese crafts as mementos of your trip, Shinsaibashi has you covered. Don't forget to check out America Mora, often called Amamora, a neighborhood known for its youthful vibe and indie fashion stores. It's a treasure trove for those who love to hunt for vintage finds or quirky fashion pieces. So, whether you're a style maven, a souvenir collector, or just a curious wanderer, Shin Saibashi is sure to captivate your shopping senses. Shin Saibashi is truly a shopper's paradise. Number seven on our list is indulging in Osaka street food. Here, the streets are not just walkways, but a banquet of culinary delights. Imagine a place where the sizzle of grills, the aroma of spices, and the multitude of colorful stalls create a symphony of senses. That's Osaka for you. Have you heard of takoyaki? These are delicious ball-shaped snacks filled with diced octopus, tempura scraps, pickled ginger, and green onions. Each bite is a mix of crunchy exterior and creamy interior a true dance of textures. Then there's okonomiyaki, often described as a Japanese pancake. However, it's no ordinary pancake. It's a savory treat, packed with various ingredients like cabbage, green onion, meat, and topped with a special sauce. It's cooked right before your eyes on a hot griddle, adding to the whole street food experience. Osaka's street food is a gastronomic adventure you shouldn't miss. At number six, we recommend visiting Universal Studios Japan. Unleash your inner child or thrill seeker at Universal Studios Japan, a must visit destination for all ages. This world renowned theme park situated in the heart of Osaka is a vibrant fusion of exhilarating rides, spectacular shows and captivating attractions. Feel the adrenaline rush as you embark on the thrilling rides. From the heart-stopping drops of Hollywood Dream, the ride to the high-speed thrills of the flying dinosaur, these rides are sure to leave you on the edge of your seat. But don't worry, there's something for everyone. So, if you're not into thrill rides, there are plenty of other enchanting attractions to explore. Immerse yourself in the magic of your favorite movies and television shows. Whether it's stepping into the wizarding world of Harry Potter, fighting alongside the Autobots in the Transformers ride, or exploring the streets of Minion Park, Universal Studios Japan brings your favorite stories to life in a way that's as close to the real thing as it gets. And let's not forget the spectacular shows. Witness the power of Waterworld's live sea war spectacular or be enchanted by the magical night parade. These performances are sure to leave you in awe. From the moment you pass through the iconic rotating globe, you'll be transported into a world of excitement and adventure. So whether you're a thrill seeker, a movie buff, or simply looking for a fun filled day, Universal Studios Japan has something for everyone. Universal Studios Japan is a world of fun and excitement. Coming in at number five, we have the Osaka Aquarium Kayukan. This isn't your average aquarium, folks. It's one of the largest in the world, boasting a stunning array of marine life from the Pacific Rim. Picture this, 
you're immersed in the aquatic world, surrounded by creatures of the deep. From sleek sharks to playful otters, all housed in 15 separate tanks, each one replicating a different region of the Pacific Rim. The Cayucan's layout is particularly unique. It's designed around a, a central tank that's a whopping nine meters deep. And as you descend, you're taken on a journey from the surface to the ocean floor. You'll find yourself marveling at giant spider crabs, awestruck by the majesty of the whale shark and charmed by the antics of the penguins. Every corner turned, every level descended, brings a new surprise, a new encounter. Osaka Aquarium. Kayukan is an underwater adventure waiting to be explored. At number four, we suggest discovering Tsutenkakutawa. Nestled in the heart of Shinsekai district, this iconic tower stands as a symbol of Osaka's resilience and innovation. Soaring to a height of 103 meters, the Tsutenkaku Tower has been a beacon in the city's skyline since its reconstruction in 1956. Now, let's talk about the view. As you ascend to the observatory deck, the city unfolds beneath you. Day or night, the panorama is breathtaking. You'll see the sprawling cityscape, the hustle and bustle of the streets and the distant mountains framing the scene. It's a sight that truly encapsulates the spirit of Osaka. But the tower is more than just a viewpoint. It's a testament to the city's history and its forward thinking nature. It's a place where tradition meets modernity, where past meets future. And it's a place that invites you to see Osaka from a new perspective. Tsutenkaku Tower offers a bird's eye view of the city. Number three on our list is visiting Minu Park. Stepping into Minu Park is akin to stepping into a painting, a verdant tableau of nature's beauty that spans over 960 hectares. Nestled in the outskirts of Osaka, this park is a testament to nature's resplendent charm. At the heart of Minu Park, you'll find the famous Minu Waterfall. It cascades down from a height of 33 meters, creating a symphony of sound that is both calming and invigorating. The waterfall, often enveloped in a gentle mist, adds an ethereal quality to the park, making it a picture-perfect spot for nature lovers. But it isn't just the waterfall that makes Minu Park a must visit. The park is a living canvas that changes with the seasons. During the spring, the park is adorned with cherry blossoms, painting the landscape in hues of pink and white. Come autumn, and the park transforms into a riot of colors, with red maple leaves setting the park aflame with their brilliance. Walking through the park, one can't help but marvel at the diverse flora and fauna that call this place home it's a haven for bird watchers with over 3,000 species of insects and multiple species of birds found here. And yet, despite its proximity to the city, Manu Park is remarkably tranquil. The sounds of the city fade into the background, replaced by the rustle of leaves and the gentle murmur of the waterfall. Manu Park is a breath of fresh air in the bustling city. Coming in at number two, we recommend experiencing a traditional tea ceremony. Delve into the heart of Japanese culture with this serene and contemplative journey. The traditional tea ceremony or chado, which translates to the way of tea, is a practice that's deeply rooted in Zen Buddhism. It's not just about drinking tea, but about mindfulness, aesthetics and connection. The ceremony encapsulates the Japanese philosophy of Ichigo Ichi-ai, meaning one time, one meeting. Each tea gathering is seen as a once in a lifetime event, encouraging participants to cherish every moment. The process is a dance of precision and grace. The host meticulously 
prepares the tea. From cleaning the utensils to whisking the powdered green tea known as matcha into a frothy brew. Every movement is deliberate and thoughtful, creating a mesmerizing spectacle of tranquility. The guests too play an integral role. They admire the tea utensils, engage in conversation, sip the tea and savor the accompanying sweet treats. It's a shared experience, a moment of mutual respect and appreciation. Immersing yourself in a traditional tea ceremony is like stepping into a different world where time slows down and the clamor of daily life fades away. Whether you're a seasoned tea connoisseur or a curious traveler, the ceremony offers a unique insight into the Japanese way of life. It's not just about the tea, but about experiencing the artistry, the history, and the spirituality that underpins this beautiful tradition. A traditional tea ceremony is a soothing and enriching experience. And finally, at number one, we have the Tenjin Bashisuji Shopping Street. Known for its extraordinary length, Tenjin Bashisuji stretches for an impressive two and a half kilometers, making it the longest shopping street in Japan. It's an unending parade of shops and stores where you can find virtually anything you're looking for. From traditional Japanese wares, quirky souvenirs, to the latest fashion trends, it's a shopper's paradise. But it's not just about shopping. Tinjin Bashisuji is also a culinary hotspot, offering a smorgasbord of local delicacies. As you meander along the bustling street, the enticing aroma of takoyaki, okonomiyaki, and other Osaka specialties wafts through the air, beckoning you to take a bite. And the best part, you're surrounded by the vibrant energy of Osaka, immersed in the local culture and everyday life of the city. It's not just a street, it's a living, breathing slice of Osaka. Tenjin Bashisuji Shopping Street is the ultimate Osaka experience. So there you have it the top 10 things to do in Osaka. From the grandeur of the Osaka castle, the bustling energy of Dotonbori, to the shopper's paradise of Shinsaibashi, Osaka is a city that never fails to excite. Let's not forget the mouth-watering street food that makes the city a foodie's dream. The adventure continues with Universal Studios Japan, where your favorite stories come to life. The Osaka Aquarium Kayukan immerses you in the underwater world, while the Tsutenkaku Tower offers breathtaking views of the city. The tranquility of Minu Park provides a peaceful retreat, and the traditional tea ceremony allows for a moment of reflection. Lastly, Tenjin Bashisuji Shopping Street offers a shopping experience that's truly unique to Osaka. Each of these experiences contribute to the city's vibrant tapestry, making it a must-visit destination. Osaka offers a mix of history, culture, food, and fun. It's a city that has something for everyone. 